Hey y'all, my name is Tani and I love to cook. But today I'm not gonna be cooking. Today I'm gonna show you this delicious fruit that I'm grilled that I found at my local grocery store. <gasps> oh, it's a jackfruit. Now it's super ripe, so I'm gonna cut it open and see how it looks on the inside. This is my second time having a jackfruit. My first time I had one was when I was in California visiting. So you can see there are some brown spots where there are some green. So let's cut it open and see how it looks. Okay, so this is the tag on it. Now, I was so excited because I found this at my local Publix grocery store in South Carolina. Typically, you would have to go to an Asian market or specialty store. So, let's see. It was um, $1.19 per pound. So this was about 15 pounds, so I paid about $18 for it. I'm just gonna take my knife, ooh, and cut it down the middle how I would a watermelon. Jackfruit is um, a tropical fruit that you'll find in the islands tropical places in the Caribbean. Oh, I didn't get this quite straight, but. Ooh, Ooh. I'm excited y'all. This thing is huge. So I'm gonna have to find a few different ways to prepare it. Okay. Let's see. Wow. Oh, it smells good, y'all. Wow, okay, let me cut some more. This is the jackfruit. So you can see their little pods that have a seed in them, so you don't eat the seeds. Look at that, y'all. Okay, so I'm gonna put on some um, cooking gloves because I'm not gonna be able to eat all this myself. So I'm gonna to start peeling a little bit of the pods from the seeds and placing it in the freezer as I figure out how I'm going to eat this whole thing. So I have a, I have a bowl here. So let me get a small bowl to put the seeds. So here's a seed, okay. So it's like you pull the meat off of the... Oh, that's good. I don't know if there's a neat way to do this. So this is the juicy fruit meat. And that's the pot. Sometimes in Asian markets or even um, any other market that has the fruit, you'll find them cut in half. Oh, goodness gracious. This is gonna take a minute. I should have looked at some videos on how to, how people who grow this in their backyard cut it open. Let's see if I just cut it in wedges like I would a watermelon. The thing is the outside is very prickly though. So it's kind of hard to grow, ooh. Hmm. Well, this isn't gonna be pretty, y'all, but. Ooh. So here's a wedge that I cut. 
So basically, I'm just plucking out the seeds. Oh, so here's a whole piece that I was able to pluck out of its spot. Okay. Some of these pieces I'm peeling apart before I get the whole thing out. But it's cool to try something new. Oh. So you open it up, get the seed out, and eat the flesh. Very cool, y'all, very cool. So it looks like there's a somewhat orange pod, and then there's some white stringy stuff around it. So I won't keep the white stringy part, I'll just get the light orange pod. The flesh, yep. Huh, well you need a team of people to break this thing down, it looks like. Any parts that look overripe, I won't keep, I'll discard. Okay, so here's the white part that I'll discard, and then the seed on the inside, I'll discard. Very, very cool. So what I think I'm gonna do is get a lime and squeeze it over this jackfruit because I'm not gonna eat all this today. Um, I think what the, the jackfruit that I am gonna eat tomorrow, I'll squeeze with lemon and then some jackfruit I'll just stick in the freezer without lemon or lime on it. Just to help keep it from turning brown in the refrigerator overnight. <clears throat> I definitely am glad I have on these gloves. Besides it being sanitary, these pods are um, wet and slippery. So the gloves help me have a little bit of grip as I'm peeling them apart. 